Well, hello. Thank you for your interest in this vintage uh, White Cross waffle maker. Um, I'm I'm not an expert on vintage appliances. I I mostly specialize in old Coleman lanterns and stuff. So, but I'll try to give you the best appraisal on this I can. Um, I got it out, dusted it off. I only cleaned it with window cleaner. I didn't try doing any deep cleaning on this or anything like that. Uh, one of your questions was on the Bakelite. Um, on the two handles on the side, there's no chips out of the Bakelite. But as you might be able to see, the very edge of the finish shows somewhere. The handle on the lid seems to be fine. The other issue in a Bakelite, you'll see in one of the pictures, part of the uh, plug is broken off, but it seems to function. Um... The outside seems to be in really good shape. There is some burnt on, uh, I guess, cooking oil or whatever from use. I didn't try to get that off. I don't know how oven cleaner would affect this finish, so I didn't mess with it. Um, the only flaw I, I saw at all was there's a couple spots here that appear to be white or gray. I don't know if the finish has come off or exactly what caused that. Um, the chrome on the dome, if this was a, a vintage Coleman lantern, I would rate the uh, plating at about 95, maybe 96 percent. It's very, very good, but there is a couple little age. I, I don't know if they'll show in the video or not, but uh, you know, from, from two feet away, it can't say anything wrong. Um, the temperature gauge, it works. I got this guy plugged in. It's kind of smoking right now, I guess. There, there's some old cooking oil on it. Um, but I'm sure this will make waffles. The cord, I'm going to unplug it. The cord is a uh, woven fabric. There's no flaws that I can see in the fabric. There's no fraying or anything like that. The uh, male part of the plug seems to be in excellent original condition. Um, I'm trying to read the name on it. Bel I think it says Bel Air on it. I can't read that. So anyway, this is where... Oh, the... I'm going to see if I can pick this up without burning myself to show you the bottom. Um, there you go. It says White Cross. There's some tarnish around this leg, but the rest of it seems to be really decent shape. I gotta set this down and flip it back up. Yowie! That's hot. Okay, so anyway, that's it. Thanks for your interest. Um, I don't need to get rich on this, but, you know, give me a fair, reasonable offer. We haven't used it. I'll sh figure out what shipping will be, and I can get that out to you. All right, thanks again for your interest. Have a good week. Bye.